But speaking of shows, we got another segue there, actually. This one's coming to Apple TV Plus. Monarch. Uh, what is it? Legendary. Mo- uh, you know, Legend of. Le- uh, Legend of the Monsters. Legend of the Monsters. Oh, Legacy. Le- Legacy no, it's Legacy of the Legacy Monsters. Legacy of the Monsters. I refuse to call it that. I'm just going to call it Monarch. Um, we got a new trailer. I. I'm intrigued. I'm intrigued. Obviously, we we've seen some uh, Zilla in there. A few hints of Kong as well. You know, uh, John Goodman is in the trailer. I'm pretty sure it's the stuff he was recording in uh, Kong Skull Island that we got in that uh, trailer. But yeah, um, I'm I'm intrigued. But, uh, what do you think of the trailer? I'm very excited. I feel like this is, um, for me, I feel I'm. I'm I, do you know what? Kong vs. Godzilla was was all hype. That was definitely a movie with all the hype. This, on the other hand, I am very excited for because I just know it's going to be a great, you know, mystery kind of thing. And it's going to, you know, it's going to be, you know, it's kind of like how what the first Godzilla movie did. I love that film. I know a lot of people kind of like, eh, Godzilla's in it for, what, eight minutes? And I'm like, yeah, I get that. But the story in the film kept you gripped with the human side and it's we're going to see more of the human side because the human side stuff in in uh kong versus godzilla i just i didn't dig it you know even with the the cast yeah. they had you know obviously you know millie crazy? bobby brown go on this franchise this god the version of this franchise this reboot it's nearly 10 years old mm. it was amazing they've kept it going that long um but yeah go on you were saying millie bobby brown yeah, and obviously the uh, the kid who is I don't know his name. Uh, he's in Deadpool two, Fire Fist, um, and obviously, yeah, Julian Dennison, and obviously um, the the dude who's like conspiracy with them, the older guy. He's um, in obviously Brian Tyree Henry. Uh, um, yeah, and, um, Paper Boy, Paper Boy, Paper Boy from Atlanta, or um, he was also yeah he was in um bullet train as well mm. uh, he was really good in that yeah no i'm i'm excited for the the human side of this and i feel like it'll be done much yeah. better than now that but do you think this will be the, the biggest sin of this show would be if we didn't get that much godzilla in it because they've shown stuff in the trailer but what if we only get an extra minute of godzilla compared to this do you think that'd be quite a big, you know, letdown in this show? Because this show, to me, it's not about the monsters. It's about the the organization, Monarch. But I feel like they're still trying to market it as a Godzilla, or uh, especially a Godzilla show. But for me, this is just about the organization, and we're going to get little bits of uh, Godzilla and maybe Kong throughout. I'm fine with that. I'm f- I'm fine with that, but I feel like a lot of people are going to be disappointed. Yeah, I feel like it's going to be the same situation as the first Godzilla. It's like it's a great film. It's just not enough Godzilla for what it, you know yeah. a film. I get it. I get it. The the film is called Godzilla, and you kind of want to go in expecting crazy, over the top explosions and actions and stuff, which you know you do get in the film. But it 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 focuses more on the story than anything, and uh, I feel like this is what this show is going to do. It's going to focus on the story. It's going to fo- focus on Monarch. It's going to f- focus on the mysteries, and the you know the brief hints of like past civilizations and um, you know the previous movies they've done, all the black ink, uh, esp- you know, bl- uh, black ops and top yeah. secrets. I'm 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 down for this. I I'm, I'm really down for this. Yeah. I um. It looks like I'll it's going to jump into the, them early stages of like you know like all the files you see. Like yeah, the of, uh, that's what I want. That's what I want. I, I hope it. I hope it does it well. Yeah. I hope it's not just some stupid chip because I, I I really hope they pull this off, which I think they will. Um, great great uh, casting with uh, obviously White, yeah White Russell and yeah Russell. yeah. Exactly, both playing the same character but at different times. That is fantastic. Yeah, so um, I've got a feeling it's going to be Kurt Russell's character, like re- like telling his story to someone, yeah. and then potentially, yeah, yeah, I, I could see that. Um, obviously, this is going to be on Apple TV. I don't have Apple TV, um, but this, this if intrigues I'm not... me to get it. See, there is some good things on Apple TV. There's there's for all mankind, which is brilliant. I I love that. Um, 
I, I, it's not like the best show in the world or anything, but I just really enjoy it. It's to do with space and stuff. It's like an alternative history. Um, but Kinnaman. with, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but the the for me personally, um, which if you don't know, if you have a PlayStation Five, I still think it still goes on. You get like six months for free on Apple TV if you go to the app. So if you like go over to the app and go down, it's you you got free six months to. You know, for Apple TV with your PlayStation Five. Yeah. Um, so yeah. I'll, I'll just, if I've still got that, I'll use that. But yeah, this is um, this is coming out in November seventeenth. Mhm. So I'm not sure on an episode length yet, but um, yeah. I think it will be quite beefy. Yeah. yeah. Hopefully. Just, off topic completely. Are we getting the Continental this month? Are we? I think is it this are. month? Yeah. Oh shit! Hell, Hell yeah. yeah. Could be wrong. <laughs> 